Hi, my name is Kirby Frazier. I'm 23 years old. I am enrolled at Lone Star College and I'm here to talk to you a little bit about photography, specifically the enlarger used in photography. Um, a few semesters back I decided to take a photography class because it seemed interesting. The class turned out to be very time-consuming and expensive. Uh, it's a fun hobby but there's a lot of processes to it. You see, in photography there are a lot of different processes. After you use your film, you have to go into a completely black room, take the film out of its original case, put it into a different container, and develop the film. After that, you can use the enlarger. This is going to take place in the dark room, which is actually a red room. Well, you use a red light bulb in it. Um, what it does is it protects your, the paper that you are printing your pictures on from becoming completely exposed. The process of using the enlarger comes in whenever you put your film into the negative sleeve holder and the light from the head of the projector shines through that paper. With the enlarger, you can make the image bigger or smaller. And after this, you use a focusing knob to focus the picture and make it clear. With the enlarger, you use the light from the head of it to shine through the negative sleeve. The negative sleeve is going to be introverted colors. For example, if somebody has a white shirt on and you take a picture of them, their shirt is going to be black in the picture. What the enlarger does is it shines through that negative, emitting light through the clear spaces. Since the person's shirt shows up black on that sleeve, the light doesn't shine through that part, and the paper that is light sensitive will stay white. It's a very confusing process, and the enlarger is not a difficult tool to use. Once you understand the concept of it, you get it. It is a very expensive piece of equipment, and it can weigh at least 60 pounds. And that's basically all you need to know about an enlarger that you use in photography.